Hey, hello everyone and welcome back to another Minecraft map. Today, guys, we're going to be playing a map called The Family Treasure. It is a map made by Cloudwolf. Here he is. And I'm pretty sure we've played some of his maps before. Um, I'm pretty sure he made The Christmas Accident, which we played for a Christmas special a few years ago. Me and Travis did. Um, so yeah, so hopefully this is a pretty good map. I remember The Christmas Accident was pretty good. So, let's get started. Oh, there's music. It felt like just yesterday when I ran through the halls of this mansion, screaming and playing, but now those are just distant memories of a life now lost. He died so abruptly, far younger than most would consider old. Oh. Not a trace of him remains. Mom was so devastated that she moved to another town, but even so, all I can think of right now is the fun times we had growing up. Now it's time to leave those things and deal with adult matters, but the child inside of me still wants to find out what he hid that hid in that chest all these years. Hopefully the new owner will let us see the treasures inside. Shoot, it's the first time... or er, it's time to start the hearing of Dad's will. Go to the meeting room. Uh, on the second floor. Okay, so I guess our... our... our, our dad died? Or something? Yeah, yeah. Our dad died and he buried a treasure. And... Oh, this is it right here. <laughs> this is it right here. Okay. So we need to go to this... Third floor, I think it said. Okay, whoa, this is really cool. This reminds me of the, um, mansions. The mansions in the new Minecraft update. Okay, this, uh, we need to go to the, I completely just forgot, okay. We need to go to the second floor. Okay, we need to go down one floor. I th assume it's over here. Let's see. Yes, it is, okay. Let's go down. The music is very s kind of spooky. Okay. Go to the meeting room. Okay. Right? Is that what it said? Yeah, meeting room. Okay. Where is the meeting room? We have a very big house, it seems. Okay, this looks like a meeting room, right? Okay. And so, now that it has been 14 days since the late Gestapo's funeral, I will now read off his will. To all my loving family, I leave the last of my earthly belongings as followed. To my first born son, Lance, and beautiful daughter, Julia, I leave all of my estate and land. To my second born son, Ramon, I leave my company and its holdings. To my sister, Michelle, I leave my foreign estates. And to my brother, Antonio, I leave my entire collection of automobiles. I know you love them so. And lastly, to my youngest child, I leave all of my belongings within the house and the key to my chest. Okay, I assume we're the youngest child then. And, or that is his last will, and all stated items will be legally given to the rifle owners. And with that, I must leave you. Good day. Oh, I won't, how come he didn't give anything to the, to the, to his wife? So that's just show, sum it up here. We have plenty of work to do here, so you guys can leave as soon as you're ready. Julia, don't be rude. We all have great memories here. Sorry, I didn't mean to come off that way. Okay, this is me. I assume I'm the youngest brother. Um, it's fine. In the meantime, wait here. I'll grab the trunk. I'm sure most of you want to see what's what Dad's treasure is just as much as I do. Oh, yes, I would love to see the mysterious chest. Oh, that old thing? He loved that chest. Let's see. Let's all see it before we leave. Fine, but then we must really get to work. Get the chest out of the storage room upstairs. Okay. What? What? I thought, <laughs> this is a really, is this just like a super quick map? What What's going on? Like his treasure's already there. And I thought that was the whole point of the map. Okay, well, let's see. Where is the treasure? I think it's over here. Yes, it is. Okay. Oh, okay. We need to get back in here. Oh, it's gone. Oh, no. It's gone. Here we go. I like the next button. It's really, it's really helpful. Okay, what do you mean it's gone? The trunk. It was there earlier, and now it's gone. How did someone get in there, get in out, get in and out of there that quickly? That chest is heavy. I don't know. The better question is who took it. This place is pretty secluded. Aha, Antonio. Yes. Then the culprit must be in this very room. Oh, this is like a mystery. Oh no, don't. Er. Oh, don't be ridiculous, Ramon. That sounds like something a guilty guilty person would say, don't you think? 
that that does that does sound kind of mysterious. Um, guys, calm down. Just let me look into it for a bit. Everyone must stay here a while while I check it out. Uh, but there's so much work to be done. Who knows how long we'll have to wait here before that's for that stupid trunk. Julia, it was father's last will, and I'm going to find it. Anyone who leaves this room will be accused of stealing it. Fine, you have until tonight. All right, search for clues around the house. Start at the crime scene. Okay, I like this. It's like a little mystery. Okay, we'll go back up to the trunk, or where the trunk was, to that room, and see if there's anything there. Possibly. All right, where is that room again? Oh, yeah, here it is. Okay, it's over here. All right, maybe, like, they dropped something when the person who's stealing it, they dropped something around here. Hmm. I can't go up the ladders. Oh, <gasps> a trap door. Okay. That's how someone got into the room without having the key. Okay. Oh, they fell onto a bed, I guess? Or what is this? A table? I don't know. Okay. What's this? Lance's bedroom. Oh, the door's open. Lance's bedroom. Maybe it's hidden in here somewhere. Hmm. This is kind of mysterious. It might be Lance, but maybe... Oh, the window's broken, too. The window's left wide open. The chest could have fit through here, but it's definitely too far to jump from here. I should find the pool key. Okay, so it's too far to jump, so... Wait, is that it down there? No, it's not. Okay, I thought I saw it. So, yeah, so... The window's broken, but it's too high to jump. So I have to find the pool key. Find the pool key. Okay, where would the pool key be? Uh, maybe by the pool? <laughs> I don't know. Lance, yeah, that's his bedroom. But that might just be because it's the closest way to the to the treasure. Um, Ramon, Ramon's guest room? Hmm, where would the pool key be? Maybe... Like in a janitor's closet or something? How do I get down? I'm lost. This place is like really, really big. Um, okay, that's, here we go. Down the stairs, we go. And let's see, how do we get to the pool? Over here, I guess? Okay, there's some, lots of stuff here. Pool control room, okay. Pool tarp, please cover pool when it rains. Drain pool, key required. Okay, so I'll probably want to drain the pool. Um, can I break this? No. Maybe I need shears or something? I feel like there's something here, maybe. The pool key. Oh yeah, we need the pool key for the... Oh wait, what do I need the pool key for? I don't know, it doesn't say what it's for. Okay, well we'll try to find it. I'm not sure where it would be though. This place is like, <laughs> this place is too big. I don't really know where I'm going. I'm just kind of running around. Okay, here's another sign. Let's see what that says. Uh, towels. Okay, there's like, okay, that's the pool right there. Right? I can't see. Yeah, there it is. Okay, so that's the pool. There's some towels. All right, let's go to the second floor. I didn't find anything or I didn't find the pool key, at least here, on the first floor, so it's probably on the second floor somewhere. Just need to find it. Not entirely sure where it would be. Yeah, like, there's a pool. Oh, wait, there's a key on that side. Or maybe there's a fence there, so maybe I need to get in through there or something. Maybe there's a fence gate that I can go in. Okay, let's try going in here. Because I saw this earlier. And maybe it's hidden in here somewhere? Oh, got it, okay. Pull key, wire cutters, okay, nice. Or what was the other thing, screwdriver. Why would the wire cutters and the screwdriver be in Ramon's closet? Okay, so now we kind of think it's Ramon, maybe. Um, so there's the pull key, screwdriver, I don't know what that's for. Um, okay, let's go back down to the first floor where the pool room was with the towels and stuff. And maybe we can open it from there, or drain the pool at least, I think it said, with the pool key. Yeah, let's see, key required. So I'm not sure if the key's for, uh, okay, maybe let's go to the other side first, because I'm not sure if it's for draining the pool, this key, or if it's for getting into the pool. So I assume it's getting into the pool. 
So we'll go there first, just in case. Just to make sure. Alright, there we go. It opened. Let's see, there's some bubbles there. Hmm. There is another trap door here, but maybe that's a drain. It looks like a big sewage system down there, and the screws on the drain seem loose. Oh, okay, let's use my screwdriver. Maybe? Screwdriver? Okay, maybe I have to drain the pool, and then use my screwdriver? Okay, let's try that. Let's see if I can break, reuse this key? No, I can't. Okay. Um. Oh, what the heck? There's a big hole here. This hole in the fence looks like it was cut. Hmm, that seems quite suspicious. Oh, what's this? These shoes are wet, almost as if someone went in the pool and took them off. This key also goes in the, uh, to the pool control room. Use the key. Okay, so what are these boots? Just wet shoes. Okay, so someone was probably in the pool. Let's go back around to the control room and use this key on it. Good thing we didn't use it on uh, it before, or the, the uh, pool key for the this room here, wherever it is. Here it is, down here. Okay, and then this should drain the pool, and then I think we can open it somehow, or open the open the sewage gate. Okay. Should be draining. It's very loud. Okay. It's drained. Now we have to go back around again. <laughs> Lots of going back and forth, but that's okay. It's all worth it to get the treasure chest, see what's inside. Okay, uh, what does it say? Now let's go see what's in the sewers. Okay, we need to go into the sewers now. Interesting. So, that would be a good escape plan, going down into the sewers, because no one would really find you, and it's a big maze and stuff, usually. Okay, let's uh, use our screwdriver. Okay, that worked. Now we're down here. Here it is! Safe and still closed. Time to lug it back into the conference room. One hour later. Ah, you saved it! Marvelous, dear! Oh, we did it! Nice, okay. So, who's the culprit? Well, first, I found the trunk in the sewers below the pool. All the way down there? Yes, and I also found some wet boots outside of the pool. Now, if you would all be so kind to let me see your boots. Oh, okay. Check the people's boots. Notice, if you are really paying attention to the first person, you should be your... Wait, to the first person, you should be your guess. That is who you thought it was. Hmm. I don't know really. I don't really know what that means. All their boots. They all kind of look the same. Oh. <gasps> she doesn't have any boots. It was Julia. She doesn't have any boots. Yes, yes. I admit it was me. Oh wow, she just admitted it. But why would you try to take such a thing? When I arrived, I snuck in through the back. I snuck into his room and read his will, and found out that I wouldn't be inheriting any money whatsoever, so I decided to hide the treasure trunk so that it could be mine. After that, I made my way to Lance's room. I knew, the, I knew there was a secret entrance in the storage room, so I dragged the trunk down into the room. Then I took it out the window and threw it down. After that, I drained the pool, then I moved the it into the sewers and filled the pool again. Oh my gosh. It was almost time for the meeting, so I hurriedly kicked off my wet shoes, dropping the key, hid the items in the closet, and walked in through the front door just like I had arrived. Oh my gosh. So, should I call the cops? No, I think that would be more harm than good. Why don't we take a good luck, take a look at the treasure? Okay, we get to open the chest. Oh boy. Okay, let's see what's inside. See, kids, there was no need to betray each other's trust. It's just old photos. Sometimes the real treasure is the memories you take, whether they're your dad's memories or ours. Or is it? Find out next time in Hartsville High. Yeah, that's right. Gave away the Easter egg. Thanks for playing. What Easter egg? Okay, so it was just old photos. Well, that's nice. All right. Yeah, it's just all photos. Well, that's nice. All right. Well, I hope you all enjoyed that. Um, sorry if the music's a bit loud. Um, but yeah, so I hope you all enjoyed that. That was a nice little map. I like that. 
Um, so, if you did enjoy, make sure you like to like and subscribe if you haven't already. And uh, I'll leave the map uh, link in the description below if you wanted to find out. I think there might be possibly different ways to do it because I had these wire cutters and stuff. So there might be different ways to do it. I'm not entirely sure. So yeah, so I hope you enjoyed. And I will see you in the next one.